Hey guys, check it out. I finally did it. It's been 10 years <laughs> of using a lot of improvised tools, homemade DIY stuff, you know, that has worked, but nothing like what this stuff's going to do. So um, I went to uh, woodysrocks.com. Uh, Caleb over there, he is just a fantastic guy. Um, his YouTube channel called uh, Powderman. Uh, I'll put the links down below, of course. Um, yeah, so <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> I've been, uh, this last week has just been, you know, every day at work, this is all I'm thinking about because I'm so excited about this stuff, you know. Um, this is going to be awesome. Um, I've really been wanting to uh, get into rockets. Um, so I ordered 4 ounce, 8 ounce, and 1 pound rocket tooling. Now the 4 ounce is on back order, and that's okay because it'll be here when it gets here. Now, um, just the level of machining on this stuff, especially for the price point, is absolutely unheard of. Um, I am super impressed, and I'm going to show you something with that star plate here in a little bit. But first, I'm going to take you through this, and you guys can check it out. Uh, this is what's called an insert maker. Now you can get these in different sizes, you know, for different diameter tubes. Um, I got one inch because you guys have heard me talk about um, wanting to build a really big cake. So this is going to make short work of that, especially for making my shells. Um, now you can get these drilled out for quarter inch or visco. I got mine drilled out for visco um, just because for me it's going to be easier and I have limited quarter inch views. Um, so what you do is put your piece of visco down in there, put your tube over the top, you take your rammer, and you pound a clay plug, and you make a shell. So that's really going to speed up that large cake that I want to do. It's, it's, it's really going to help out a lot. And I'll be ordering more stuff in the near future. Um, I've got a whole list. Uh, in fact, I can tell you this. I've never spent so much time on a single website before in my life. <laughs> Literally, uh, probably an hour to two hours a night for the last week. Um, that's crazy. Uh, but let's check out this rocket tooling. Uh, let's check out this one pounder here. Now, these have nice polished uh, stainless spindles, uh, good heavy duty base. Uh, when I assembled these, this rod fits down in there, but there was such a level of, of, of machining that that there was virtually no play in that whatsoever um, and that's pretty much unheard of you know like I said before especially at these price points um, now he's anodizing uh, most of his stuff now so the anodizing adds a level of protection too which is fantastic now the rammers you know they they're all drilled out they've got the uh, no pass lines they come with the uh, pull handle just like this one does um, Allen wrench now, the star plates. Um, I've got quarter inch, three eighths, half inch, and three quarter. Uh, what I like about these, which is different than a lot of other people's, is the fact um, that it's basically fill them up once, press it, and you're done. So you don't have to fill them up twice. Um, just because of the uh, depth of the uh, female plate here. So, what I want to show you here is okay, I'm going to take this plate take the female, place it down, and I'm going to take the male. I'm going to show you this. That's one. I'm trying to do this through the camera. That's two. That's three. And that's four. So, did you guys notice that? You can put that in any direction you want, and it's still going to function. Um... That's really difficult to do because if one of these pins is off just a few thousands, that doesn't work that way. Now, that's a level of machining that is completely unheard of at this price point. Now, I'm assuming it's done with a CNC, uh, but even a CNC can be off, you know, thousands. So, I'm, I'm super impressed. Um, these all come with um, um, the pressing plate and the spacer bars. Uh, these are the uh, small plates, so they can be used in an arbor press. Um, so there's my arbor press. I modded that a few years ago, opened up the throat. I didn't want to cut that off, um, but I can still put my, uh, my plates in here. So, and I set it up so I could ratchet it, ratchet it up, and then press it down. So 
Now, oh, also got a media separator. So he's got the uh, Rebel uh, ball mill jar uh, on sale right now for like 95 bucks or something like that. And uh, But anyway, so before I start just rambling on all the stuff that I want to buy, um, I've got two announcements. <laughs> um, I'm officially a grandpa. My granddaughter was born May 31st. Healthy, happy, 10 toes, 10 fingers, and just a bundle of joy. I went and seen her today, and to be honest, it brought tears to me. She's, she's just beautiful. So, um, Second announcement is I've hit 3,000 subscribers. Woo! Right? So Caleb was kind enough to send me up some swag for this. Um, I've got a few other companies I'm going to talk to um, that I've dealt with over the past. I've got some stuff I'm going to kick in, but I'll have an update video on that. Well, probably in about two or three weeks. So, All right, guys. Take care. Let me know what you think. Talk to you later.